is where I want to be When I'm down, I'm in the sea Looking up at monsters in the clouds Red's the color when you're dead If you find me gone, I'm just in bed Reading up on fairy tales instead No one knows so many things Go feet and I go wings To carry me back home To my house that's made of bricks But that's just such a fix To ever hold me down What is what? Skunk. That looks good. Oh, um, hey, you have to do the uh, the water first, um, and then the suds, and then the water again. Um, to like rinse it. Is it hard? Oh, it's it's really hard, <laughs> but I, I like it, I like it when something's clean because you you see it dirty and then you clean it, and then it's clean and you wash it and it's clean and then it's done. Cool. <laughs> I'll see you later, yeah? See ya. Hi, Mr. Oswald. Hi, darling. I don't get it. Why is Rick the one they arrest? I don't know. Buckley. He 
forced himself into doing it. No, no, we, we... Yeah. Dad! The dirty, retarded fucking Hi, Mr. Oswald. Hi, darling. Ah! Mr. Oswald, I want to report a rape. You are a fucking prick! You, you do me. your fucking job! Just this calm, fucking rapist down, needs Mr. to be put behind bars! Your daughter uh, has wife. not been raped! What the fuck are you talking about? Your daughter's a virgin, Mr. Oswald. She's never had intercourse. Of course she fucking has! Dad! She's, Dad, she's, Dad she's right. It never happened. I only said it did because I you wouldn't believe what I told you, and I didn't want you. But I don't. Alright, you don't have to be afraid, uh, Mr. Yeah, Osmond. Shut up, Mr. Osmond. Shut up. Of them, of him. You don't have to be afraid. They should all be put in a home. They should. Him in a jail. You're out of love. Bloody animals. You hit him really hard, Dad. So I heard. You want to talk about it? No. You want me to stay with you until you fall asleep? That's okay. Can I have my hand back? Sofa. Oh, right. Archie! Yeah? It's Tuesday. My wages. Oh, crap. Um, can I pay you tonight? I won't forget, I promise. Yeah. Oh, early riser. What time is it? It's ten past eight. Oh. I thought it was like eleven or something. Where do you think you're going? Just lie down. No, you're not. Get back in here. Get your breakfast. Bye, Dad. Hey, bye, love. All right? Scrambled egg. Do you not have anything better? We have scrambled egg. What? Nothing. I'll be out in the back. What? Just saying, cancer and all. You'll catch it. Yeah, well, you make your choices, don't you? 
so annoying. Move. Hi guys. Come on, Gee. look, this is a six. No, this Stop is a nine. That. Come on. Mike. Yeah. When you're a teacher, Blit. will you still bring us treats and stuff? Uh no. That's all gonna have to end, skunk. Really? Well, <clears throat> you see, the relationship between student and teacher is by its nature. You won't be our teacher. Well, you never know, Jed. Mike. By nature is what? Well, it's adversarial. What does that mean? Well, it means that it'll be my job to see you as the enemy. He's full of shit. Somebody only worthy of my contempt. Mike. And you'll begin to see me that way too. Mike. Mike. Whose goes it? Yours. Yours. Okay. I won't ever see you that way, Mike. Aww. It's because you're in love with them. No, no. Guys, guys. In my experience, the person who brings up the subject of love is more often than not the person who is in love. Really? <laughs> Shut up! Yeah, You're blushing, Jed. <laughs> what about you two? Are you in love? Mike and I, of course. Then why aren't you married yet? What's the question? All good. Uh huh. Night. Night. Close your curtains. Have you called Dr. Curtis? Oh yes, but he says uh, he can't act in any way without Rick's permission. Well, she won't give. Oh, but this is what I'm saying. He won't come out of his bedroom, Archie. Janet sits outside his door all day trying to talk to him and nothing. I, I, I'm sorry to drop in on you like this out of the blue, but I just, you know, I, I just thought, I thought, well, Archie, he's a, a solicitor. You know. So you want you want to take this matter further? You want to make this a legal matter? Bloody legal action? No, no, no. Forget it. I, I, I don't want anything more to do with the bastard. Oswald? Yes. Why not? Because I'm scared of him. Just really bloody scared of him. And you went under the water, five years old. <laughs> And your father ran so fast across those stones to get you. He got you. He saved you. And then... Hi, Mrs. Buckley. Is Rick in? Why? Don't know. Just thought he might like to hang out or something. He's your love. He can't come out. Oh. Okay, well. Goodbye, no love. Bye. And anyway, 
Then we bought you that matchbox tank. I remember being so brave. <laughs> and you tried to give it to your dad because he'd cut his feet up running over those stones. So kind you were, so... I mean, what five-year-old in the world would have done that? Huh? I was wondering if we could have a little chat. Chat? Yeah. Yeah, absolutely. Okay, well, um... I know things have been... tough for you since Barbara passed away, you know. For you and for the girls, you know. And what with everything that's been happening lately... I just... I, I wanted you to know that, you know, if ever you wanted to talk. Talk? Yeah, fuck off, Archie Wheeler. All right, um, what I wanted to ask you was, um, if you could ask your girls to give the Buckleys a break. They've been having a tough time of it lately. Have they? Yeah. Oh, that's really awful. When's the last time you cried, Archie? Cried? Yeah. I don't know why. It was the next time you will. It's the next time that you criticise my girls. Now, hang on, in any fucking way whatsoever, all right? They're out of bounds. And if Buckley can't take a little friendly fucking ribbing, then he's more of a pathetic prick than I thought he was. I'm having my dinner, mate, so if you don't mind fucking off. Thanks. You know what will make it better? A Blu-ray player. Yeah, well, you can't have everything, Jed. No, I'm just saying. I got you that ashtray, didn't I? That's what I'm saying, scum. It's brilliant. It's the best ever. It'd be great if we never had to go back. What, to school? Yeah. I don't know. I'm kind of looking forward to going, actually. Oh. First year. What? Sometimes, when you're walking down the corridors, the older kids will punch you. What? In the stomach. <laughs> Idiots. Which way are you going, will you? Listen, mate, it's not our fault you can't ride your bike. It's not my bike. And I can ride it. What's this? Whose is it, then? That is a travesty. Hang on, hang on. Right. You ready? Get away from the bike! So who do you live with then? My auntie. Where's your dad? He's dead. Dead? He was killed in a fire. Along with my mum. That's terrible. And my sister. I don't give a shit. I was only five or six at the time. Oh. Wow. Cool. My mum ran away with an accountant from Birmingham. Yeah? So are you a lesbian? No. You look like a lesbian. What does a lesbian look like? Kind of ugly. Oi, skunk! Please, no, I, 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 I can't, 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 I
No, he's not. Bye bye. Off you go back to your halting site. I know Pikey. That's racist, Kasha. Sorry, mate. She's polar. Skunk! Bye. You don't look like a lesbian. No? So why'd you say I did then? I don't know. Because I'm ugly? No, you're not. You're really pretty. Am I? No. You're ugly. See ya. Don't sit outside his bedroom door all day, sorry. It's that kind of babying. Babying? Yes. But you don't know whether you're coming or going, but look at yourself. When's your last time a shower? Ah, you sound insane. I'll break the ugly. My son needs to know I'm here. I'll just leave. Don't break it. Get out of this room. Rick, open this door. If you don't open this door, I'll just. Rick, coming in, you. The doctor they had there, how long they could keep him in, and uh, he said indefinitely. Right. Is, is, that, is that true? Well, um, if a patient's been sectioned, they have the right to keep them in as long as they see fit. I see. I'm sorry, Dad. Stop it! Wait, hang on. You saw that? Cash fell asleep in front of the telly one night. Oh my god. What's she drinking? Well, I'm joking. Oh. They cut a part of his brain out. Who? McMurphy. <laughs> Stop it! Jed! Look, listen. That is not gonna happen to Rick. Okay? Are you sure? Yes. How do you know? Because I just know. Well, that sort of stuff, you know, it just isn't there. No, 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 All right. Let's go and make these things fly. Person, unless you plan to stay with that person, you know? Fucking hey, coward! Get the fuck down. Fucking coward. Asshole. Are you and Mike splitting up? Go to bed. And the things he said to me, you know what he called me? What? Obsessive fucking bitch. Yeah. Fuck you. So worn out with it, Archie. You know? Well, we could sue him, I suppose. Yeah, for what? I don't know. A dereliction of premarital duty. Very funny. How about just for being a dick? Yeah, we could get him for that. A lazy dick. He values his freedom too much, his comfort. Well, most men do. That's why we need that push. I've been pushing long enough. Four years. I'm 35 years old, you know? Really? Fuck off. I can't wait anymore. I just can't. Is that my way? No. Morning. 
what are you doing here? Just thought I'd knock about. Dad isn't here. So angry. And she was crying and I think she really loved him. Yeah? I think she wanted him to get married. Or buy a house. Or have a baby, maybe. Right. I would have married him. Yeah? Mm. -hmm. Oh, well. Really cool. It's like, come in. You're a really cool girl. Thanks. For a lesbian. Do you want a knickknack? No, thanks. Must be a pain not being able to eat what you want. Do you want to be my girlfriend? OK. Can I have a kiss? M maybe later. All right, but later my mouth's going to be all nicky-nacky. All right. But not a splasher. A what? No swirly tongues. <laughs> OK. Child, big day tomorrow. Good night, Dad. Good night, love. Good night. Very attractive. <laughs> yeah. All right. Yeah. Good. Yeah. <laughs> hey, where's mine? Night, night Kasha. Kasha. Very funny. And don't forget teeth. You want a drink? And if you're in trainers, they'll stomp on them. Bang! And if your hair's too long, what they'll do is they'll grab it from behind. All right. And they'll just start. Stop! You need to know about this stuff, skunk. The better prepared you are, the better you'll do. So, what they do is they grab your hair from behind and they just start snipping away with a pair of scissors. So you pick your moment? Yeah. You let them know the arrangement? Yeah. What? The deal. Why? And then they know where they stand? Yeah. Which is? Nowhere. Absolutely fucking nowhere. <laughs> it's, it's funnier later on. Okay. <laughs> What about Rachel? What about her? If she walked in right now, 
Would you take her back? You must be joking. Not even for the kids. Why? So they could live in fear of her walking out again whenever she felt like it? No, thank you very much. They wouldn't even know who she was. Poor Archie. Poor Kasia. I'm off to bed. All right, then. Good night. Good night. You can follow me up if you want. Why aren't you in bed? Jed said I was going to get my head flushed down the toilet. By who? In school. And you believed him? And punched in the stomach. Yeah, I believe him. He said it's, he said it's tradition. Well, I was told the very same thing when I was your age. That's the tradition. What is? Putting the fear of God into the first years. And nothing's going to happen to you. You lie next to me till I go to sleep. Dad. Karen in school, it's gone. Oh. Not Mike. Oh, right. Well, in that case, you can call me Miss Cunningham. Fair enough. Okay, everyone, my name is Mr. Kiernan. Uh, Miss Cunningham? Yes, Mr. Kiernan? Um, how is Kasia? Kasia's fine. Okay. You, um, say hi to her for me? Do you have a message back? I do. Dick. Excuse me? That's what she said. How many did you get? A hundred. Shit, I'm one of the long ones. I must not use an appropriate language. What the hell did you just do that for? Sit down. Give me some money. What? Some money? Why? Because I want some. And if you don't, my sister's gonna kick the fucking shit out of you. How much? All you got. Get it all out. You as well. Go on, quick, hurry up! Now every week, from next week on, I want two pounds from each of you. What? That's what it costs to stay off the list. What list? The list of fucking death, bitch. Here's your shit fucking losers out of thing, fucking robot. It's broken. What? The cow! The absolute fucking ugly... Come on. How many did you get? 200. Hmm. Must be one of the bad ones. Mm -hmm. Can I get a new phone? You've got a phone. It broke. Can I get a new one? No. Why not? You should have taken better care of the old one. It'd make me so happy. Mm -hmm. 
quite a skunk. I'd just be the happiest child. I'm trying to work with her. Happy delirious. It's just not fair. I don't care. You don't care about me. Yeah, he doesn't care about me. Go away, skunk. He hates me. That's what he said. Please. Stop it. Please, Dad. He wishes I was dead. What? Nothing. Emily! I don't want to hear it again. Do you understand me? Do you understand me? Emily. What time is it? Ten past ten. Do you think he's learnt his lesson yet? <laughs> Who's this? <laughs> Susan Oswald. Slut. No, she's not. Told you. <sighs> they call that. Philatia. I have to go home. Where have you been? Why didn't you call? I don't have a phone. You little brat! How dare you do what you just did! Sit down! Yes, she's here. She's fine. Sorry, Dad. Are off. You can never forget how important this is. I know. I know it's routine. I know it's hard. So it's okay, Dad. What? I said I was sorry. I have to say it's okay. It's okay. What would you do if I died, Dad? I can't even answer that question. Would you cry? Huh? A lot. I don't think I'd ever stop. What if I... Tell me about the night I was born. No. Oh. I, I don't know why. I get I, the night or the. The dream. Please. No. Come on. No, not again. Tell me. Why do you. I don't even know why you like this. I just do. Come on. Alright, well, it's about this woman. Mm hmm. And different times different in, her, moments. in her life. Different moments. Like what? I can't remember. Think. I can't remember. Try. Um, well, some of them are sad, mm. but most of them are happy. Mm. And the woman was me. And the woman was you. And the dream was my future. I don't know about that. I mean, that's what it felt like, yeah, but, yeah. But what did I look like? 
hideous. You're nice. Stunning. And then you work. And then I work and I was happy and I was sad all at the same time. And mum was there. She was the one that woke me up. And she said... Archie, Archie. She's, she's here. Meaning me. Meaning you. Well, you were the one about to be born, weren't you? Oh, skunk. I can't help. Talking like that. It's his medication. Talking like what? Kind of groggy. Am I? <laughs> <laughs> wow, you got your own telly and all. Oh, yeah, you know, I, I, I watch. Um... I'm sorry. No. School. It's fine. We're actually on a half day today. Isn't she good to come, Rick? Yeah, she is. Yeah, she has to, you know. She's really good. Mm -hmm. I always thought Skunk was really good, didn't I? Mm -hmm. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> what was it like? Hmm? You know when you went kind of mad? Oh, that's, uh... Is it alright if I say that? Actually, it's really hard to describe. But it's kind of like there was a toxic cloud. Toxic cloud? Yeah, or a, a mist of evil or something. Really? Or badness. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Is it there right now? Uh, less. Uh, in fact, Dr. Sinclair was saying at this rate of improvement, uh, Rick might be able to come home for the weekend, so that's up. When? Not, not now. No, no, no. No, not now. No, not now. But soon. <sighs> yeah, I had an uncle who was a nut like that. Thought he had worms in his ear. Oh, yeah? Yeah, like, nest in there. Shaved it all off. Been bald ever since. Is he better, though? No. He's worse. He lives in Florida now. Do you know they have lizards there? What? Lizards. Millions of them. Just walking around the streets. Hey, how you doing? <laughs> you and I should go sometime. Do you know that? When? I don't know. One day. Why? Would you come if I asked you to? Yeah. What about that guy you're in love with? Mike. That teacher. He'd understand. I'm in love with you as well. Sweet. I call that a menage a trois. What does that mean? Love triangle. Kiss a kiss. No. Nice one. Switched 
jump or something like that. Play. But can you just listen there? Hello, fatty. I haven't got it. I haven't got it. So are you fucking joking? Let me go. Let go! <laughs> fucking laughing. No. Sorry, Sonia. Bitch, you're gone! History, yeah? You're now officially on the list. Just you fucking wait. Dumpy little turd. Does he die? I can't tell if he dies or not, because that's why we read. Fine out, okay? But let's just all agree there is a chance that he may die, all right? I don't want him to. All right. <clears throat> now, why do we think he goes on? Kevin. Well, his life is rubbish, wasn't it? And boring. Well, it's through the doors. There could be wicked shit. Like dragons? Yeah. Like yeah. dragons and shit. Troves. Yeah, yeah like she did. Yeah. 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 Oh, yeah. oh, 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 is the definition of courage, right? Being afraid, but doing it anyway. I still would not go. Of course you wouldn't be. I wouldn't want to die. He doesn't die, Vikram. You told me the end! Why did you have to go? Frigid slot. Please! Hold her! I'm trying. <coughs> we'll kick her while she's down, man! Mom! Properly in the room! Wash her! Do it harder than that! Do it in the room! It's not the arm! Okay, will oh, you next time! What are you doing? What the yeah. hell is going on here? Come on! It's going here. Listen, if you fucking touch me like that again, I'll report you. Oh, you report me? Yeah. How old are you? Come on, what? she's half your size. Oh, fuck off, you pedo. Come on, get out of here. Get out of my side. Hey, Sunrise, get back here. Oh, yeah, that's my Stay sister. Right Don't talk to Stay my sister right like that. Stay right there. Come here. Fucking Stand quit. There. Stand on there. You, be quiet. What are you listening to him for? He's a teacher, sir. Yeah, just get out of here. Get out of my In the next side. two weeks, you're going to come here for a, for a... Sunrise, look at me. For an hour and a half's detention after school starting tomorrow. Do you understand? Do you understand? Do you understand? Good. Go home. She had a bit of a run in with another girl, but we sorted it out and everything's fine. So, you know, don't worry. It's... Mike rescued me. Really? Mm. We have a jam sandwich. Okay. Go change out your uniform first. Mm. <coughs> Here, I'll, I'll get it. I'll... You know, it's kind of weird, isn't it, when you're in the middle of something, how things can be so uh, confusing, mm -hmm. you know? Unclear. What are you talking about? No, whereas, you know, what I'm saying is, whereas with a bit of time and a bit of distance and perspective, things kind of... Look, whatever you want. Sorry? The house, the baby, whatever you want, I'll give you. That's very kind of you, That's Mike. What I'm saying. It took me, I don't know, stepping away. To get a perspective. Yes, and to realize that the things that you want 
Kasia, the things that you want are, are, are the things that I want. Mike, I'm with Archie now. I'm sorry. You're with fucking Ar Archie? Yes. As a lover? <laughs> well, I want. I are you in love? Yes. Well, I'm so, I'm so I'm happy for you. I'm so fucking happy for you. Mike! Mike! When I'm really old, one day, one day, when I'm really old, and when my hair falls out, I'll stick it back with a spoon of the marmalade that you I don't know. Just promise you won't tell anyone. Alright. I just really... You haven't promised. I promise. Just don't understand why people would do that. It's what you do when you're in love. You're in love? Well, I am. I don't know about her. What if she's pregnant? She's not. Well, she's what if? Skunk! Whose could it be? Simon Malloy's. Okay. Jed Cunningham. Dennis Woods. Jed Cunningham? Yeah. Ugh. Who else? A couple guys. I can't remember their names. Who's that one with the dreadlocks? Brian Williams. Fucking kill me, someone. This is gonna no, fucking shut kill me. Just let me think. When's the last time you saw Miss Oswald? Uh, last Tuesday. Where? Outside the school. Um, she was attacking another child, so I had to... Sorry, did you say Sunrise? Sorry? Um, sunrise, Oswald. Susan. What did we say? Susan. Oh, right. Sorry, because I don't know Susan. It was Sunrise who I reprimanded. You don't know her? No. Well, I mean, I know her. She's in the school, but I've never had any contact with her. I see. Well, she claims you've been having an affair. <laughs> what? Well, that's insane. She's a child. She's 14 years old, Mr. Keenan. She's also pregnant. Mr. Keenan? Can I help you? Mr. Keenan? Yes? <laughs>
be back there. You know, I'll make sure everything's all right, yeah? I love you so fucking much. Dad. Oh, thanks, love. Oh, I love you all so much. Yeah? Give us a kiss. Come here, come here. Come here. Oh, come on. Let's do a big family fucking hug, yeah? Oh, I love you so much. Mm? I love you, I love you, I love you, I love you. I love you, I love you, I love you. Love you, love you, love you, love you, love you, love you. Right. Saskia, no boys, all right? No parties. Oh, fuck. Oh, no, 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 no. Fuck off, come on, come on. Bang! Get the fuck off! Go, get back in here. Go, see! Fuck out of it! I have a right to call a solicitor, don't I? Yes. I'd like to do that now. Sorry, um, Mr. Kinn and solicitors here. So this is alleged? Yes. You haven't arrested my client? Well, for the moment, he's helping us with our inquiries. I'll get your jacket. Oh, wait a minute. No, she's a liar. What? She's done this type of thing before. Another man, another accusation, essentially, of rape. Another lie. Look it up. Detective. So you, you have a decision to make. Either you release my client, or you arrest him. And then we'll take this matter further as her story falls apart. Thank you. We can thank Kasia. She's the one that asked me to <clears throat> come in for you. Yeah, how are you two doing? Well, I don't really want to talk about that. Oh. Don't you? No. <sighs> Why is that, Archie? Is that because what you have is so fucking special it can't be articulated, huh? No, it's because it's none of your business. Fuck you. You know what? Fuck you. The last thing I need beyond losing the woman that I love is to be obliged to the man who fucking stole her. Well, I didn't steal her. Yeah, well, you'd fuck... And there's no obligation. Oh, fuck off, Archie! Man, you couldn't be more fucking patronising if you tried. Then what? I don't know, love. They'll probably give him some kind of DNA test. Right. Right, you know what that is, do you? Yes. No. It's a test that'll show he isn't the father. But he isn't the father! We know that, love. She's a liar! Everyone knows she's done it with... lots of boys. It doesn't matter, skunk. Why not? Because they're boys. Mike is an adult, you understand? A teacher. In this kind of situation, they have to be absolutely sure of his innocence. And until they are, they just can't allow him to work with children. So he's not coming back? Not at the moment, no. Sorry, love. Skunk, it's your boyfriend. Birmingham. But I thought... I thought you and me were gonna go to Florida and see... see yeah, the lizards yeah, and know, stuff. But that was when we were older. Why not now, though? Because my aunt says I have to go Birmingham, Scott. What am I going to do without you? Yeah. Will you take this? Why should I? To remember me by. When do you go? Tomorrow. Early, so I'm not going to get to see you again. How long did you know that? How long did you know, Dylan? Skunk! You're only telling me now! Why haven't you told me? Skunk, stop. You're an arsehole, Dylan! I wanted to tell you, but I was afraid to. Please don't hate me. You're leaving me, Dylan. Of course I hate you. I'll always hate you. Well, oh, it's lopsided. It's OK. No, it's not. It's fine. Fine? Well, I wanted it to be perfect. Is it edible? Well, of course it is. Dave. Well, uh, the message is, uh, is clear enough. That's all you want, really, isn't it? Yeah, well, I suppose. 
Well, I better go. Mm. You'll love it, Janet. to know that if you wanted me to, I'd be the daddy. The what? The, the dad uh, of the baby. T take responsibility for it. You and me, we can get married. Jesus Christ. Are you being serious? Yeah. We're having a party in here. I just don't call over again. But... You okay? Why didn't you tell me and Jed about you and Kesha? I'm sorry. Just trying to find the right moment. You're gonna marry her. <laughs> Kesha, I know you're there! Are you? I don't know. Because she'll leave us, Dad. The way she left Mike. Like Mum left us, like everyone does. No, I won't. Yes, you will! Don't lie! It'll all go wrong, Dad. Everything always goes wrong. Why do only bad things happen? Good things happen. Like what? Your sex with Kasha? What That's about me? Or Jed? Or Rick? Or Mike? What about Mike, Kasha? Mom, you get need to out! Stop. I don't want to talk to either of you! Just get out! It's my room! So let's, as much as we can, confine things to the home for the weekend, OK? Yes. Just to be safe this first time yes. out. Thank you, Doctor, yes. Not at all. Best of luck, Rick. Thank you. Have a great weekend. Kick about, eh, Rick? I think I'd rather stay inside, Dad. Oh, well, yes, you're probably right. Best to, best to play by the book. <laughs> oh, uh, Mum's made a cake. It's, uh, it's, uh, it's a bit lopsided. Just uh, thought I should warn you. <laughs> What's going on here? Uh, nothing changes. Well, we won't let it bother us, huh? What's, uh, what's happening? Oh, just don't pay any attention. Um, what are you doing? Well, I, I've got it. I forgot the milk, so oh. just put the kettle on. It won't be long. 
Why well, isn't she talking? No, but she's not even moving. No, but she's not moving. Just hurry up and get over there. Just tell them. Nick, come on, Rick. Just, just, just come inside. There's nothing going on there. There's any interest. Come on. Look, right, let's go in. Let's go in. Perfect. Okay, it's because of fucking scum like you that this is happening. Just you sicko! Nice God, just piss off inside, you fucking pervert! Fucking evil bastard! Oh, fucking hell. Right, let's go in. Let's go in. Come on, Rick. 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 Come on, Where are you going? To, to my room. But... Just, just for a But I made you a cake. Of... I'll, I'll have some later, Mum. But you just go here. Rick, please don't go to your room. Please don't. Don't mind what those people said. Please don't. They're right. No! They are not right. They are not right. They could not be more wrong. Rick, you are kind and you are good. You are so lovely. They're right. No, they're right. No, you love it. No. Come back. I need to call someone. It's going to be all right. All right. Don't say I'm bad. No, 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 no. Don't say that I'm bad. Like before. They have to come and look after you. You don't have to tell them. I, 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 it's you all right. You don't. You don't. It's all right. Everything's fine. You don't have to tell them. You don't have to tell them. No.
Oh, man. Yeah, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm gonna kill her. Maybe. Maybe what? Maybe what? She knows she can't come and go as she pleases. Call her again. She knows that from the last time. Skunk. Yes, Dad. Yeah, listen, love. I'm really, really, really worried. So, could you call me, please, Dan? All right, it's Dad. Where are you going? I'm going to look for her. Dad! What? I think I might know where she is. Archie! And you come here to... Just hang out. Who's got a cigarette? They're not mine. Can I just... Really can I just talk... Time. Can I talk to you? It's not gonna take long, please. Okay. I just wanted to ring this once just to say... I don't know... I... Just to say sorry. All right. You know, thank you for... For today and for... You know, for... For helping me out. For Archie too. Okay. He, um, listen, I was... And I wish you the very best. All right. And I... Will you do one thing for me? Yes. I wonder if will you just apologize to Skunk friends. for me? We spoke to her friends. We spoke to all of her friends. For all the embarrassing shit that, 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 that she's had to witness. So, no, so my daughter... Okay, Mike. ...has type 1 diabetes. Do you understand? She has type 1 diabetes. Because she's a terrific kid. So, without, if she doesn't stay monitored. Okay, now just. No, go she away. could die! Dad. Do you understand me? You know, on Sunday, she's just gonna blow us all away. Do you reckon she's. Cash, that someday she's just gonna blow us all away? Anyway, that's uh, all I have to say. Have a good life, yeah. You too, Mike. I just want your goodness. I just want your
Dad come home? No. Where is he? Don't know. Rick! Yeah, I can actually look at them. Archie! Come. It's in the... Uh, Archie! No, it's six, for, uh, 13 drum and close. I don't fucking know, it's just... Archie! What? I don't fucking know! Uh, some, a bit, some people have been stabbed as well. Please! Yes! Thank you. Uh, Archie! Where's my dad? And there were different times in her life, different moments. Some of them are sad, but most of them were happy. And the woman was you, and she was stunning. And, um... Are you ready? What's it like there? Then your mum woke me up and she said, Archie, she's here. Yeah. 
Mark. You're my girl. Come back. Just come back. Please. Shall we go? I'll be back in a minute. Why won't you say goodbye? Please, Dad, just, just say goodbye. Where I want to be